Divya is playing on an iPad, an everyday activity for many children across the world. But for the 13-year-old from Bangalore, India, it is a lifetime opportunity. At age two and a half, Divya was diagnosed with autism. For her mother, the diagnosis came as a shock. It was devastating. Looking by what people said about what autism was, I was very scared and nervous that there's no future for her. Sita Lakshmi takes her daughter regularly to computer classes at the Autism Society of India. Here, the so-called Prius Lab provides children with autism spectrum disorder the opportunity to learn computer skills. Project Prius was initiated by 10 SAP volunteers. SAP supports the lab with hardware, money, and software donations. We started the Prius project two and a half years back with workshops for children, parents, and educators who are involved in the field of autism to train them on uh, use of iPad as well as devices for education, mainly in the area of communication. Communication support is essential because due to a neurodevelopmental disorder, people with autism have deficits in the area of communication, socialization, and cognition. The core deficit, the social challenges, and along with that, um, there are some children and individuals who have problems in imagination and their thought process works around few interests. So there is a lot of repetition in them. To help autistic children communicate, a team of volunteers from SAP Labs in India has developed a free online platform called learnforautism.com. Here, parents, educators, and practitioners can build and share content related to the autism spectrum. With this initiative, the Prius team aims to build the largest repository of free content for autistic children. For Kavita Sharma, technology is an enabler that perfectly fits the needs of autistic children. Technology has brought in a lot of hopes. It has got predictability in its approach. The reinforcers which are given while the child is working are very subtle. There is no voice modulation. Where it is like a non-threatening tool to them. At Project Prius, Divya's example shows how autistic children benefit from technology-enabled training. Divya's mother now has hope for her daughter's future. We understand her potential much more by her use of iPad apps. I'm sure she would be able to fit into the, someday fit into the IT industry. For Anka Wittenberg, Chief Diversity Officer at SAP, it's always a revelation to see hands-on what kind of potential people with autism have if trained accordingly. I'm taking home from this visit that the buddy system that we have used here to have somebody from SAP or from the teachers be a buddy to a person with autism is really a, cru a crucial point for us to be successful. But something else I've really learned at Prius is everybody's thinking here, how can we take that into the next step? Based on the experience at Project Prius, the next logical step for SAP was to hire people with autism. The software company has just launched a global project to employ 1% of its workforce from the autism spectrum by 2020.